the team. Okay. <sighs> okay, how many... How many pieces of cheese do you... You got all the cheese in it? All of it? No, I got two more slices. Okay, keep on doing that. Turn them into the four little squares. I put them all over it. <laughs> yeah, but you made me get the well, cow out. I know. You got to keep the cow because I want to tell you what to do with the cow. Believe me, I know what I'm. I, I wouldn't tell you nothing wrong. I'm, I'm gay. Gay people know how to cook on me, like a beast. When I say like a beast, baby, I mean like a beast. Making me tear up cheese. It's taking forever, y'all. I usually just take it and just like, oh, fuck. I know, but is you're not supposed to. <laughs> you're really not, honey. I love putting the cheese go <laughs> kerplat. I love making the cheese go kerplat in the pot. <laughs> Yeah, we like our cheese melty, 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 uh-huh. Okay, you got all the cheese in it? Should I do another white one or just mix it with yellow? Uh, do another white one. Yeah, don't put no yellow. Oh, well, hold on. Yeah, do another white. We don't want no mixture. We want white. What color is the cheese in the packet, though? Jared. What color is the What color is the cheese in the packet? Yellow, but I guess it doesn't matter. It's not going to. It's not going to because I'm going to tell you what to do. My temperature raised is 27 here now. Oh my God, I lost signal on the thing. If you get the last piece of cheese, let me know. But you better hurry because it will not melt. You have to do that shit like super fast. Okay. Now you got the cheese in it. My body on his body, baby. You've got all the real cheese, did it? Yeah, now it is. Okay, you know that package cheese, that pack. The powdered cheese. Yeah. What about it? Where did he go? Gotta call him back. Wait a minute, Burple. I'm calling you back.
There he is. There we go. Okay, you know the powdered cheese? Yeah. Okay, you take one pack of that and pour it in it. One pack. And you better hurry because it will not melt. I'm telling you, it will not. So pour that in. Now where did it go? This has got no my nerves. Now what the heck is going on? Okay. Now I can't. Did you pour the powder cheese? I'm working on it. You keep hanging up. Okay, just one pack. Now take the meal. Do you got a tea cup? All right, put the second one in. No, don't put that one. Don't put that one. Do you got a teacup? Like, like a measuring cup? No, a teacup, like a coffee cup. Oh yeah. A small one. Like that? Yes. Okay, do you see that uh, where the handle is? Yes. Fill that cup to that top notch of that handle. Yes. Do you see this top, the inside of it? Yes. That. Yes, down in there. Oh, I can't believe that bitch hung the fuck up on me. Now that cup of milk. I'm gonna keep calling your friend, bitch. Now what? Pour, pour it on. A, pour it. Pour it in a round circle. All the way around it. Keep going all the way around it. Now, take that thing and stir it really, 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 really good. And I mean fast motion. How cheesy is it looking? Oh yeah. Huh? I said oh yeah. You ever put milk in it before? Yeah, I, I've done that before. 
gonna do with the other packet? Keep it. For what? There's no point. Uh, yeah, you can use it on something else. Yeah, you can. Alright. I need a glass of milk right now. Okay. Why the fuck y'all keep fucking with me? Like, pick up when I fucking say pick up. Call you don't fucking pick up. But yeah, it's okay for you to call me. Fuck off. You know, even though I didn't have a good time on my freaking date last night, I still end up sleeping with this fucked hard. Well, yeah, but guess what? We're having a cooking date right now. <laughs> yeah, I ended up sleeping with that. I ended up sleeping with that fucked hard. I'm like, what the fuck? Show you my Bluetooth sound system? No. Oh my god, the fucking kitchen is smoky. What? I said, oh my god, the fucking kitchen is smoky. It looks like we blazed up in here. It's because you left it set there that long. Don't let those fucking things get down in the burner. No, they're not. I got them. Not sure. I turned it off anyway, so.
Was you guys busy today at work? Um, I don't know. I guess fairly okay. I was going to say, like, because I was, put, I was, like, thinking, like, you know, it's the third of the month, and usually places are busy, man. You, do you know that's where McDonald's gets the most of their business? Do you know that? I'm going to send you a picture of it. Hold on. What? It said, look, Shelby, have you tried it yet? No, why do we keep getting hung up on? I have no idea. I have no idea. I can't answer that. Maybe. Oh, God, my back hurts, Jared. fucking stuck my arm right into my remote control and it hurt like a motherfucker. <laughs> oh my god. That hurt. Alright, I think it's time to try this. <laughs> I wonder which bowl I had last night. Try this.
Yeah, we should have added the other packet, though. Why? Wow. Because it needs to be more cheesy. You can still add it. Yeah, we need to add the other one. The only thing about it, when you add that other pack... Yeah? Uh, you need to pour like this a tad more milk. Oh, I already knew that. <sighs> Probably a little, bit, a little bit more milk than that, baby. Because if you don't, don't, all that powdered cheese is going to just clump up. Do it this way then. That's it. Yeah, kind of way too much, but it'll thicken. Yeah, it will. Sounds weird. What? Listen. Oh my god. <laughs> like a wet pussy. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know, I just really like eating puss. <laughs> Have you ever ate a puss, Jared? Do what? Are you still a virgin? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, I didn't know. Have you ever ate a puss? No. <laughs> I refuse to do that. Well, I, I've tried it, and it's not no fucking fun. Yeah, exactly. It doesn't look like it. <laughs> Not to me. I had a girl one time. We was at a party. Yeah, but who knows where they had it either. Well, it's not that. It's not just that. That don't bother me. <sighs> that don't bother me because I look at that. It's not going to bother me because it's a fucking dick and I like dick. So, anywho. This bitch, I was drinking anyway. We started fucking messing around. Next thing I know, I didn't eat this bitch's puss. <laughs> I'm not lying. And it was fucking horrible. I'll never forget. I was like, I'm going to stick to sucking dick. <laughs> I was like, at least dick does not have a fucking horrendous taste. Mm. And that's the truth. Dick does not have a taste. Now I need my To me, it does Yeah, I 
I was just writing that to somebody one time. I was like, dick don't have the taste. Plus, yeah. All right. Poor girls. Ah. And I used to talk to this one girl. Her name was Tony. Her name was Tony, and man, she used to fuck the hell out of me with a strap on. <laughs> I ain't playing, dude. This bitch was bad, man. She'd fucking punch you in the back of the fucking head, doll. Tony was her name. She had fucking tattoos everywhere. Bitch was badass. I don't know, but it's just like weird. I don't know. You get that still on you like. I mean, I did that. I did. I acted like a bunch of girls when I was in high school. Like multiples. I don't know. I was just like, fuck it. I don't want no fucking puss. I'm looking for the penis. I think everybody experiments. That's me. I don't know. Do you think I'm wrong? Not really. Uh, no. Right. Well, well, can I ask you something honestly? Sure. Have you ever did anything with a guy? Nope. Never? Jokingly. Not like physical. Like what? Not physical, but being like... Like what you do. Like, oh, yeah, that type no, of thing. No, I'm not, I'm not talking about like that, no. Then no, not physically. You've never, like, jerked off with another dude? No. Okay, well, maybe, maybe everybody doesn't, Jared, maybe everybody doesn't experiment. Maybe they don't, so maybe I was wrong. Have you ever had a guy hit on you in real life? Oh, yeah. Really? Yeah, the fucking Meet Me website. <sighs> okay, can I ask you an honest opinion? Of something? An honest opinion, because we know each other pretty good. <laughs> okay, I'm not saying who or what or when or whatever. But, like, what is your, like, reaction? What would be your reaction, though? Like, okay, let's say you were sitting beside of a gay dude. Okay. And a gay guy was to grab you by your junk. What would you? What would be your first reaction? What would it be? I don't know. You'd probably get fucking punched. <laughs> Hello? So that'd be your first reaction. That'd be normal. What 
What are you here? See if I hear it again. Something probably doesn't like what the hell I'm listening to. But I just always wondered from a straight guy point of view what you would do. Sounded like footsteps, but nobody was there. Okay, Jerry. You're straight, okay? And I trust to talk to you about this, okay? I went out like, it's been like two weeks ago, okay, with my best friend. Okay, Jared, he's supposed to be straight, okay? You got me? Do what? Okay, I went out like, maybe it's been about a week ago with my best friend. He's straight, okay? I mean, he's straight as fuck. Okay, well, he was just me joking with him, and I was like, I, his name is Zach. I'm like, Zach, why are you not scared of me? I'm like, you're straight, I'm gay, you know? And he was like, well, because I love you. Okay, now listen to this shit, and you tell me what you get from this. Okay, I looked over at him, and I'm like, well, what would you do if I was to reach over and grab me you by your dick? And he just looked at me and smiled. Like, I mean, how do you take that? I don't know, maybe he liked the idea of it. Oh. And like I've noticed, Jared, I could be like sitting beside of him or something, you know? And, like, I could rub on his leg, like, get real close to his junk, and he never does do nothing. I don't know. Maybe he likes it. He's just not showing it. And, I mean, he always gives me a hug. And, like, the other night when we went out, it was raining. And he put, he fucking put his coat over my head. Second bowl, I'm getting full. Oh. No, I can. If nobody else eats that, I'll kill that whole pot. But I'm just glad. That That me and you are still talking. Uh, uh, we don't do the, We don't have the problems that we did have. Uh, I'm just really happy with that. Like really. Uh, I don't know what to do now. <laughs> I'm exhausted. What's wrong? I don't know. What? I said I'm exhausted. I don't know, but what's wrong? Tired, probably. Just body tired, not mental tired. What time did you go to bed last night? I don't even know, actually. <laughs> did you see Tim today, you said? Yeah, he, well, he, he has a job now, and he was working, uh, he does, uh, what the hell is it? Oh, last I knew they were working at, working on a roof of a burnt building. Well, how's he doing? I don't know. I don't talk to him. I know, and I don't, like, 
Why are you guys not talking? He's always working, and then when it, when he's done work, he's going out with my sister places, so I don't ever see him. I oh, was him and your sister dating? Yeah, but we're not, him and I aren't on bad terms. We just don't see each other. Oh. And shit, the work they do, he probably is tired. Well, your cousin, the one that I used to talk to, do you talk to him any? Uh, he was here not that long ago. Really? Yeah. I need to message him. Be like, how you doing? Where does he live at from you? Um, not far. Has he got a girlfriend now? I think so. I didn't know what ever happened to him. He was working at Costco and then he got into like this big building or something. Oh. I'm not sure what works. Well are you at are you at Ron Ken? Not really. Well, how the hell did he? How the hell did he come to live with you? Oh, because his mom had, didn't find a place yet. Oh. So yeah, my sister moved out, and he took her room. So now he's got his own room, all decked out with guitars and my loudspeakers, and hooks up the eight, um, aux cord to the laptop. And blare music. Oh, hell. Either that or we hook it up to the Sony and crank it up to 30. How the fuck does your dad handle that? He ain't here when we do it. Yeah, but you don't need to be doing that, Jared. What, blaring music? Yeah, like how close is your neighbors? Oh, they don't care. They 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 know for they're always at work. Oh well. If I'm off, everybody on this block works. Uh -oh. Except for like um, my grandparents and their neighbor. That's it. Everybody else, I think, works. Oh, your grandparents live there too? They're across the street, yeah. My mom, my little brother, my sister, my gra it's my mom, my, my sister, my little brother, my mom's boyfriend when he stays over, Tim when he stays over, my two gr grandparents, and they have two dogs. Where do they live now? <laughs> right across the street. <laughs> and you live with your dog? And I live right across the street from them. And it's me, Dad, and Ryan. Oh. Well, I didn't know you. Had, I didn't know you had a little brother. Oh yeah, I do. How old is he? Six now. Do you all look alike? Separate dads. Do you think he looks like you, though? Uh, a little resemblance. More, 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 uh, more acts like us than anything. <laughs> See, we can talk about other stuff than stupid crap. See, but then there's something about our, there's stuff about our family that, like, our friends don't know. Like, we don't take any crap. Like, when friends would start stuff here, like, we had two people, well, the, the black dude that was here the other night. When him and his girlfriend used to live here, um, that, his girlfriend was stealing my sister's clothes. 
world. So she got pissed off one day and threw all her shit in the front yard. The other day, uh, Daryl and Christina got into it right in the living room. He goes, uh, she says, uh, what the hell was it? She goes, you don't own this place, you can't tell me to get out. So, so I said, um, so I said, um, I walked out there and Dad wasn't here. I was like, alright, well, since Dad's not here, I'm in charge. What's going on? She goes, She's arguing with me and bitching about me about nothing, Daryl goes. And Christina goes, no, you started this first. And I'm like, all right, Christina, get the fuck out. Where does Daryl live? He's between here and Justin. Who? Justin, my other black nigga. <sighs> oh, God. Yeah. <clears throat> yep, my other black nigga. What? I'm going to have to move to Pennsylvania and we're going to have to get an apartment. I'm going to have to move. It's like I got a best friend who lives in Philly. You have a best friend in Philly? Yeah, I got several. That live there. Uh, there's a place in Philly, South Philly. I know a guy whose dad and mom own a nightclub. Oh, all right. In South Philly, it's called Shut and Tell. And a dude, I know his grandparents, or I know his parents own it. It's a strip club, basically. But he's gay. Oh, yay. All right. Fuck. Oh, I just bitch on. I love you. You're cool. Ian, I heard about this young man. Do I get a big hug? Hold on, I'm waiting for Skype to open. Someone else wants to join our call. But anyway, Joe, that's what I was going to tell you. I'm getting ready to head to bed because I'm falling asleep on you. Oh, alright. Well, I'll just call her then. I want a big hug. A hug, a belly hug. Oh. <laughs> but you need to get, you need to go to sleep yourself. I know what I'm thinking of doing is letting my movie play and watching it until I fall asleep. Yeah. It's called. What it's time do you get off tomorrow night? Ten, ten o'clock. Well, I'll call you around 11 or something. Yeah, and then I'm off Sunday, so we could probably... Or, uh, yeah, I'm off Sunday, so... I mean, I don't know if I'm riding to church or not, so... I gotta look at that Saturday night as well while we're on there and see which route I want to take to go to church. Because it's, it's an hour bike ride, probably. Uh. But well, I'm going to get off here and go to sleep, but I'll talk to you tomorrow night, okay? Well, tonight. All right. Good night. Love you, Jerry. Get some sleep. Oh, yeah. Bye. Bye.